All right. This is, this is my second video of the day. Got a day off from work. Took a day of vacation. Kids' first day of school. Walk my little one in the kindergarten. Hell, I got two older ones in college. Jesus, Lord have mercy. Anyways, Chase Bliss Automatones here. Just come today. And honestly, I think unboxing videos are stupid. But I'm going to make one anyway. So, let's see. I honestly am very curious. My first reaction to see how big this thing is. Because, to me in the videos, it looks gigantic. Which I really don't care. Whatever. Sold a whole bunch of my overdrive pedals on reverb. Which I knew that I wasn't going to need. That was the Boss OD200. Strymon Sunset, which I had for about a week. I liked it. Got rid of it. Boss OD200 was pretty cool. I had that about six months. Uh, Chase Bliss Brothers. I really didn't want to get rid of that. But I'm like, well... Fuck it. Just sell the damn thing. Because I got it for... I think I bought it for used 260 and I just turned around and sold it for 300 after a week. And the Sunset I got for good price. And sold for, came out even on that, so no loss. Let's see. Oh, Lord! Have mercy, sweet baby Jesus, Lord! Oh, God. Oh, God. Hmm. I'm big into keeping boxes, because if I don't keep something, which this one I know I will, but I like to sell it with everything. That ain't that big! Is that on camera? Yeah, it is on camera. That shit ain't that big. How that small? Is oh, I got a big muff. Hold on. I got an old ratty ass big muff. I tore apart a long time ago. Let me see. I say ratty. I say ratty. Oh, fuck, those dimensions are almost exactly the same. I don't know why everybody was stressing about the size of that thing. That is literally the same. That's identical. I guess that's what they were after. Well, I answered my biggest question about this one. I know it's going to sound good. I was just curious how big it was. Hmm. Ain't that big. Fucking big muff. I always hated that damn thing. Yeah, cool, man. I was curious because I used a Temple Audio mounting plate. And I was hoping that the bottom was rather flush. And it, it does look like it is. So I'll be able to get one of those on there pretty easily. Oh, cool, man. Uh, what else we get in there? Let me stick the box back over there. Let me set this off to the side for a second. Uh, Chase Plus stuff. Uh, stickers or something, sure. Um, Preamp Mark II, Chase Plus good. Uh, sticker, uh, something else. Instructions. Uh, quick user guide for MIDI, looks like. And that's probably about it. There you go. I did my first unboxing video. That was stupid. Anyways, I was really curious to how big that thing is. So I guess in a nutshell, more people probably have big muffs than they have anything else to compare that to. That is virtually identical size, height and dimensions to a big muff. Ah, Lord! Yeah, so that may answer a question for a lot of people. Fucking hey, man. I'm going to plug this thing in and eventually have to rearrange some stuff around on the pedal board. Uh, ye old pedal board. Going into ye old Victory V30. This is my beautiful garage. Play guitar, pay bills, cut the grass, work on stuff, work on other stuff, work out right there. Universal one-stop one shop and man cave. Y'all have a great damn day.